bit composition at the moment. 10 banelings, 40 zerglings, 3 roaches, 5 queens. The maga always goes for a lot of queens. Here comes a changeling as well, hoping for some kind of uh, inspection, scouting purposes, I'm sure. Army count 112 against 87 from the maga. The maga is falling behind on his army count. And um, let's see, uh, he's just destroying the rocks here. Will he be doing an advance on this small corridor? Usually this is not very beneficial for the Zerg player, so the Terran player might benefit from a big fight onto, onto this corridor, but seems like that the Mag is not going to have none of it, at least while these rocks are still up, he's not going to take care of them, and he's just advancing once again into the Zelnaga Watchtower and keeping tabs here. Here he comes, the Marine Marauder Ball from uh, Maka advancing, Siege tanks getting sieged, blasting away into those... Um, those zerglings and seems like that the maga has to pull back it's too much of a, of a, a force here from maka prime let's check the units once again 35 marines nine marauders four siege tanks this is much too um, big for um, the maga to fend it off scan going down the reinforcements from the maga appearing there it's a lot of zerglings with banelings meanwhile there's once again another drop here while the assault is happening on the um, on that third base that the MAGA has placed, as you guys can see here, here they come, third base almost finished, but the forces from MAGA Prime advancing. Will the MAGA be able to hold off to this base? I don't think so. And notice how MAGA Prime noticed that the Banelings are around, and he doesn't want his units to be completely melted away by the Banelings, so he's making small groups with Marines and Marauders, and slowly poking at this hatchery. Hatchery almost down. The MAGA needs to set some forces here. Very well placed, this siege tank as well. Just every time Maka pulls back with his units, he starts blasting with the range of the siege tank. Very effective there. The Maga placing a lot of defenses here, making sure he's going to be able to uh, fend off this assault. Another small group from Maka Prime advancing. Oh, this hatchery is going to go down. And he lost his hatchery. As you can see as well, there's another movement going there from the left side. There it is. The Maga preparing a second wave from that side, another group here is splitting into three groups and I think he's going to make a big surround move. This is going to be a brilliant strategy by the Maga, not sure how far this will take him. Once again Maka sending a small group ahead, making sure that there's Banelings there and yeah there is Banelings there. Oh, surround really quick there and nice move by the Maga, oh massive explosions with Banelings, surround going with a lot of Zerglings trying to destroy the siege tanks. Very well played by the Maga, shoving away all the forces from Maka Prime, and there's only a small Marine Marauder Ball left, but there's not much left from the Maga forces as well. He had to pull back, he sacrifices a lot to get Maka Prime to, lo to lose his position, to lose the ground where he was standing in, and once again it appears that Maka Prime will be uh, able to get p map control and dominate the map at least till this halfway here to the to the Zalnaga Watchtower. Meanwhile, here he comes, second, uh, second command center, second expansion, getting landed, built and landed on this expo here, while the Maga lost his zone there, and it appears that uh, the Maga is now considering advancing into this corridor, kind of risky, but Maka Prime is going to make a big push. Marine Marauder Ball with a lot of siege tanks. Look at him just slowly gaining his ground. Trying to get some visibility to shoot down everything that moves ahead. And now once again sending a small group of Marines and Marauders leading the way. They're going to be the sacrificial Marines and Marauders. Here they come. <laughs> Whoa! Away from Zerglings trying to poke at that small group. And meanwhile there's another drop going on here with the Medivac. Maka Prime just making several small groups and using some guerrilla tactics, slowly advancing and testing the forces from, uh, from uh, the Maga. Here comes big wave of Zerglings, gonna surround here, kill these forces really, really quickly. And meanwhile, the rest of the bulk of the forces is just getting slowly placed here, lots of siege tanks, and containing the Maga into playing into th two bases at the moment. And um, let's see how his main base uh, still has some minerals, getting mined out slowly, but still has enough minerals. Here it's fine as well, but he's basically contained while Maka Prime is profiting from his third base, working just fine. Income-wise, he will be ahead, obviously, as a huge advance, 70 harvesters against 34. The Maga is not in a good position at the moment. Another drop going down here on the main base. Beautiful play by Maka Prime had to be shoved off but he keeps having the Maga on his toes trying to contain any advance and Maka has 
this front line here and this group of marines and marauders dropped by Medivax. Two fronts of assault along with another Medivac dropping on the natural expo. So much offensive going on here that I'm not sure how the mag is going to be able to hold this. Yeah, look at him. <laughs> I think he's just freaking out completely. Maka Prime wasn't able to pick up these marines. Most of them got completely grinded and seems like that the Mach is just landing his marine marauder force there just for a while preparing his next assault. Single marine Rambo slowly shooting at this evil chamber there. Oh, now he's gonna get complete, completely grinded. Yeah, over. Another push going on here. There's a lot of banelings there getting ready to advance onto the units from Maka Prime. 25 banelings. What else is getting produced here? More siege tanks, more marines Marines and upgrades incoming, infantry armor, and here comes the ball from the MAGA advancing into this Medivax, beautiful fungal growth right on top with banelings exploding on the face of those Marines, nice play, more Marines getting uh, sent into the fray, oh beautiful transfusions there keeping those Queens alive, and it appears that MAGA wants to destroy himself, this destructible rocks, his reinforcements are waiting there on the back. And here comes the Mago with his queens trying to advance, making some transfusion play, I would say. Poking at those units. Nice transfusion there once again. One of the, king, the queens got lost. And Maka slowly just surgically advancing with his siege tanks, poking at everything that moves. And here comes the Maga advancing. Whoa! Big, big explosions from the Banelings melting against all of the forces from Maka Prime, but there's so many coming from this, those destructible rocks. I don't think that the Maga will be able to hold off against this huge army from Maka. Here he comes, and the Maga just GG's out of the match. Big army that Maka had waiting, holding on the back of those rocks. Impressive stuff there. And it appears that he was already getting ready to pick up his fourth base. But well, the Maga lost. He lost 2-1 the series, and Maka has a fine Terran player, taking the lead and taking the win on this situation. Hope you guys enjoy it. See you all later. Have fun.